Gus, a 1-0 defeat of them, Barton, what your thoughts on the game, please? I was delighted. I thought we played really well, you know, against a, a very experienced team and certainly got a physical strength about them. Um, we've lost the goal to a set piece. So I think considering, you know, the, the new faces that have come in, how we are trying to play, um, a lot of positive to take out of that. Um, I'm very pleased. Took a wee while to get going in the first half at once, we found our feet with were more than a match for them, but created plenty of good chances as well. I didn't think there was anything between the teams, you know, I think that's the, the major positive that we take from it. You know, with, you've only got to look at their squad, you know, the experience that they've got in there. Um, we're throwing on young players like Ali Miller and Calvin McGrory um, and getting a taste of what it's like, which I call real football, mm -hmm. you know, beyond the reserves and development. This is real football now. Um, albeit we say it's early stages, but you can see that as soon as it becomes competitive, the, the type of players that we've got and the, the way we want to play, they just switch in, you know, onto that mode. And I, I thought they were excellent. You mentioned a good test for the younger players, but there's also seven players in the starting eleven making their debut. You must be delighted with the performances that they put in as well. Yeah, there, there was a lot to be pleased about. Um, the, the most pleasing for me was uh, Kian Summers. You know. To go in, it's a sort of frustrating period there uh, when he came to the club, you know, one thing after another. Um, but you can see that he's worked extremely hard during the close season. He's looking fit, he's looking strong, you know, defensively and offensively and getting forward, especially in the latter stages of the game. So, signs are looking good there. You linked up particularly well with Adam Martin on the left, both players allowing each other to go forward as well at their own time. Yeah, that's what we talk about, is trying to you know, get partnerships and the players to understand each other. That will take time because there is so many new faces there, you know, throughout the team. The only ones, you know, that I recognise are the, the two centre backs with Scott and Jerry in there. Everybody else is maybe just finding their way a wee bit, you know, in terms of getting to know each other, you know, both on and off the park. So um tonight a lot of positive, you know, on the way they went about their business and, and tried to get something out of the game. And just spoke to Scott there and sent him a 24 year old. He now finds himself as certainly captain tonight and one of the more experienced heads in the, the team. Is he only 24? Goodness sake, I thought he was about 34. Um, no, I, he's, he's been very patient. Um, he's a fantastic leader. Um, he's, he's, he works extremely hard. He's difficult because he's his shift pattern that he's work. Um, but he's an example to all the, the players. Jerry's the same, you know, in terms of. His, played you know in these levels of football for many years but they're good examples for the younger players you know to what's required um, and they give us a fantastic foundation we need them fit and available so um, maybe look at Saturday maybe change one or two things up to have a look at one or two other things um, because Spartans have got a fantastic result tonight and I saw them on Saturday against Dumbarton and they were excellent well organised um, so it'll be a tough game for us on Saturday but we may need to Try one or two things. Are you be looking for a similar type of performance tonight, particularly how good we looked going forward? It'll be different because it's at Hamden. Um, there'll be one or two things that'll be different from it, even the way that we, we try and shape up a little bit to give us food for thought for the league campaign as well. And also, you know, maybe to look at one or two players as well. A couple of them have picked up knocks as well, so maybe four stoners as well. So, no, but it's plenty to be pleased about. I think, you know, the a lot of them a lot of them did themselves a lot of favours tonight. Thanks very much, Gus. Cheers, Sean.